this is from unit 2 roman numbers page number 22 question number 1 write in roman numerals so here many numbers are given here you have to write in roman numerals it is given in hindu arabic numerals but you have to write in Roman numerals. So to write in Roman numerals, there are two principles. One is addition principle and other is subtraction principle. So 16. 16 is we know 10 plus 6. So how we can write? 10 plus 6. 6 is b1 is 6 so this is x for 10 b1 means 6 so 10 and in the right it is written 6 so it is 16 next 25 it is 20 plus 5 and for 20 we can write 10 10 this is 20 and for 5 we can write like this 5v so it is 25 so similarly similarly for 27 it will be like this 32 30 plus 2 29 this is 20 and 9 ix means 9 so similarly for 14 it is 14 it is 38 and for 40 you have to use subtraction rule subtraction principle we know l for 50 and you just write a 10 a 10 in the left side this is 50 and a 10 in the left side whenever the left side is smaller then it is called subtraction so 10 minus uh, sorry 50 minus 10 it becomes 40 So for 47 it will be this is 40 and 7 how we should write 40 plus 7 5 6 7 this is 47 and 55 this is 50 and this is 5 55 50 plus 5 similarly for 69 this is 50 plus 10 that is 60 and then 9 ix means 9 69 so similarly it will be 72 and it will be 88 and for 90 you have to write 100 minus 10 we know c for 100 100 minus 10 let me write 10 in the left side x for 10 to 100 and in the left side it is written x that means 100 minus 10 that is 90 simple one and 99 100 minus 10 that is 90 plus 9 1 i x this is 9 this is 90 this is 9 99 Now come to question number 2. Express in Hindu Arabic numerals. So you have to express these Roman numerals in Hindu Arabic numerals. This is x i v. x for 10, i v for 4, 14. So it will be 10 plus 4. x means 10 iv for 4 so 10 plus 4 that is 14 next x vi x for 10 vi means 6 so it will be 10 plus 6 that is 16 
and similarly it is 10 10 that is 20 plus 2 that is 22 it will be 25 and here using subtraction principle L for 50 and X for 10 so X is in the left side of the 50 so it will be 40 40 and then this is 9 so 40 plus 9 49 and here L for 50 and 10 uh, X for 10 and X is in the left side of L so 10 minus uh, sorry 50 minus 10 it is 40 and then this is 8 so it is 48 this is 50 10 10 60 70 and then this is 6 so it is 70 and this is 6 so 76 So similarly it is it will be 87 and it will be 94 because it is 100 minus 10 that is 90 and then 4 so it is 94 100 c 400 and this is 10 and 1 11 111 111 similarly you see here this is 100 and this is 50 and this is 7 so 150 and 7 157 now let's go for the next question tick right sign uh, tick this sign the right and cross out the wrong so if it is right 45 is equal to VL if it is right then you tick it and if it is wrong then you tick the cross sign first 45 is equal to VL so let us check VL4 but you know 45 how do we write 45 40 plus 5 and for 40 we, we used to write like this 45 should be written like this 50 minus 10 that is 40 and then 5 so 45 should be like this x l v but only v l it is written here only v l so 45 is not equal to this rather 45 is equal to this so it is a wrong statement cross it next 30 30 means 10 plus 10 plus 10 30 yes 30 used to write like this so it is correct 49 49 supposed to write 40 plus 9 it should be like that 50 minus 10 that is 40 and then 9 the 49 should be like this but this is not 49 so it is wrong 96 96 it is c 400 100 minus 10 that is 90 and then 5 it is 95 but it is 96 and it is representing 95 so it is not equal it is a wrong statement similarly 49 this is l means 50 minus 10 x means 10 minus 10 that is 40 and then 9 so it is 49 it is matching correct one 76 50 60 70 75 it is 75 it is representing 75 but it is 76 so they are not equal just write it cross 68 50 60 it is representing 60 and it is representing 8 60 plus 8 68 it is correct 
101. One hundred, right? One we should write like this: hundred plus one. Hundred means hundred has their specific symbol that is C. Hundred and one. This is one hundred one, but fifty fifty one. It is not like that. We don't use to write like this. Hundred and one should be like this: one hundred plus one. C four hundred, I for one. It is a wrong statement. Just write the wrong sign. 152 it is 100 plus 50 plus 2 so it is 152 this is 152 it is true now come to question number 4 compare using less than greater than or equal to symbol using these three symbol you just compare among the numbers so the first problem lx lx means 50 plus 10 60 and xl so l for 50 x for 10 and x is in the left side of l 10 is in the left side of 50 so it consider as 50 minus 10 that is 40 so this is 40 it represents 60 so 60 is greater than 40 next c represents 100 l for 50 l represents 50 so surely 100 is greater than next it represents 25 x x v it represents 25 it represents just 20 so 25 is greater so you write greater than symbol here next number four x i v means 10 plus 14 uh, 10 plus 4 so it is it represents 14 and it represents 16 10 plus 6 it represents 16 so 14 is less than 16 you put here less than symbol next it represents l x x i i means 50 plus 30 plus 2 so 82 and it represents 100 minus 10 that is 90 and then 2 92 so surely 82 is less than 92 you fill up your less than symbol next number 6 it represents 30 and 8 38 and it represents 50 minus 10 that is 40 and 1 41 but 38 is less than 41 so fill up here less than 38 is less than 41 next lxx l4 50 and this is it represents 20 50 plus 20 that is 70 it represents totally 70 and it represents 90 because c 400 x for 10 so 100 minus 10 that is 90 so, so this is less competitively less than this so it is less than symbol you fill up here next c l i i i c 400 l 450 it represents this i i i means 3 so 153 it represents 153 on the other hand c 400 c 400 and then 4 so it represents 204 200 4 so surely 153 is less 153 is less than 204 next c x c c 400 x for 10 so it means 90 
and it means 8 so it represents totally 98 and what it represents c x i c for 100 x for 10 i for 1 111 so it represents 111 so 98 it re represents 98 it represents 111 98 is less than 111 Now let's go for the next question number 5. Answer in Roman numerals. So this addition subtraction problem you have to answer. You have to write this answer, this addition answer in Roman numerals. So let us see. It represents 34. It represents 34. And L represents 50. And we know 50 plus 34 is 84 84 but how shall we write 84 50 plus 30 that is 80 and then 4 so it represents 84 hence the sum is represent in roman numerals you have to write the answer also in roman numerals next this it represents 13 and it represents 69 50 60 and then 9 69 and we know 69 plus 13 82 13 plus 69 that is 82 but how shall we write in 82 uh, 82 in roman numerals it will be like this 50 60 70 80 and then 2 82 next question number 3 it represents 20 27 it represents 27 and it represents 40 that is 50 minus 10 40 and it is plus problem so 40 plus 27 you will get 67 but how shall we write in roman numerals 67 that is 50 plus 10 that is 60 and then 7 5 6 7 l x v i i that is 67 next okay this is 50 60 74 it represents 74 and it represents 45 so 74 minus 45 what shall we get you will get 29 so 74 minus 45 it is minus 74 minus 45 you will get 29 but you have to write this 29 in roman numerals so it will be 20 plus 9 x x that means 20 and then 9 9 means i x so 20 and 9 29 next it represents 100 minus 10 90 and then 9 it represents 99 minus it represents 50 plus 10 plus 2 62 so 99 minus 62 is 37 99 minus 62 is 37 how we'll write it 37 we have to write in roman numerals so x x x that is 30 and then 7 5 6 7 37 now the last one x i x this is 19 it represents 19 10 plus 9 it is it represents 19 and it represents only 9 so 19 minus 9 you will get 10 so the answer is x x for 10 thank you